Good to know that you're alive. Josh, you were supposed to meet me at 8 a.m. this morning. Come on, bring your ass on. You take your sweet ass time. Come on, bring your ass. Hurry the fuck up, Josh. You were supposed to meet me at 8 a.m. to finish out the studio. Okay, all right, shut up. You smell like a bottle of tequila. Did you just bathe in the shit? Look, I can explain. Okay? No, I don't need you to explain shit this morning, Mr. Perfect. And today, you're about to take this ass, Shuey. Yes, my brother, because it's my day. Today is my day to shine. I'm about to let it rain on you. I'm about to chew your ass out like how you chew me out for everything that I do. Every little thing that I do, you chew me out. So today is my day to let it rain on you for all that you put me through. I got roofied. Damn, really? Like Hangover 3? Yes, asshole, like Hangover fucking 3, but a million times worse. Did you wake up tired in the chair with your pants down because a little midget agent man tried to fuck you on top of an abandoned hotel building? What? No, it was worse than that. Wait, what can be worse than a little Asian man trying to rape you on top of an abandoned hotel building? I don't know, I just don't remember anything. That's how bad it was. Oh, so a little Asian man could have raped you on an abandoned hotel building. Enough with the Asian man, okay? I'm fucking serious. This is a really scary situation. You're right. I'm sorry, friend. Did you at least try calling the police? What am I going to tell them, huh? Please, tell me that. Oh, I went to a house party and someone drugged me. Yeah, exactly. Sounds like a pretty logical explanation to me. It's pointless. There's not enough information. <laughs> Besides, I'm gay and black. They could give two fucks about my situation. I'm just happy to be alive. Damn, man, I'm so sorry that you feel that way. But what's even more fucked up is that what you're saying is actually true. It's a fucked up, cruel world. I wouldn't worry too much about it, friend, okay? Besides, I wouldn't be complaining too much because I woke up with a really, really handsome man this morning and the only thing I had to complain about is my headache. So let's go. Actually, you could take me home because I'm going through some stuff right now. No, you're perfectly fucking fine. This is my me too moment. Asshole. What? A 2018 in the millennium, women are going through something where they go strong and say when a man has raped them, okay? You're not a woman. I could be what the fuck I want to be in 2018. Right, sir? Right? Hey, I can be what the... I can. What? No, you're a man. I can. You have a penis. You know you're what? Because this shit is not even real. You're making it up. Number one, you're not a woman. Number two. I can be whatever the fuck I want to be in 2018. If I want to be a fucking woman, I'm a fucking woman. Well, then you're finna be a woman that's finna put on some goddamn work gloves and a hard head and help me fucking fix this studio. Where, the fuck is? Where are you going? I'm walking my independent ass home. Asshole. Fuck you two then.